Mary Margaret was a writer, and she loved children. In fact, she ran this orphanage for over 30 some odd years and ran it well. The children loved playing on the swings. If you listen closely, you can still hear the sounds of the rusty chains. The workers all lived next door in trailers. Mary was very good to her staff. She considered them like family. The unbroken window lets light shine into the abundant building. A wheelchair still rolls into a room, giving Mary her goodnight kiss. You can still hear the children's laughter throughout the halls. The fan sits unbroken. and tree roots now grow out of the ceiling. The lounge that once enjoyed fun and laughter is now destroyed. The children's computers now stacked in the classroom. It now snows through a broken window where Mary used to watch the children play. None of the children were ever adopted. Mary made sure of that. She loved her children, and she never wanted them to live with anyone else. We hear the haunting sounds of Mary's typewriter. She wrote a book for each child, hundreds of them, and then she would poison them. Mary poisoned all the staff off one by one, before poisoning herself. Now, they are all buried on the side of the building they once called home. <laughs>